What did you say about doing it to the day you die? What did you just say? You said something else too. I'm planning on just making this my work, crusade for Christ, until I leave here or until help stops. And y'all retired from y'all jobs? I'm retired. I'm a mm -hmm. retired banker from Commerce Bank in Kansas City, Missouri. And what you, where are you working? I am a hairstylist and have my own business. And we are sisters in Christ and blood. Yeah. We have blood sisters. So, so, what's your job? I'm, I'm just a lowly servant. Right now, I'm uh, the, the bus captain. So I organize the route, make sure they have enough water, they have enough flyers. And what church do you go to normally? What church? I'm from West Rolls Street Church of Christ. And what does it mean to see people from all over the country come to San Antonio? It's very encouraging. I, I didn't even know people outside of San Antonio existed they, they, that are living the word and we can know the truth. It's so encouraging that the whole that the whole United States are Christians out there. What's your name? Edmund for me. And it brings blacks and whites together and Latino to bring them. It just goes to show that God God knew that from the beginning the Gentiles would be involved with them and in, in total salvation. Even though we have human, uh, even though we have the internet, Facebook, Twitter. And all of the things that involve uh, social media, nothing is more important than the human contact. People want you to talk to them personally, not by phone, not on Facebook, but the human contact is, is the most important way to reach people, I feel. Yeah. Bringing people of many races together. My so. name is Jose Lopez. I'm the Spanish uh, Minister of Congregation. This is way. Uh, two races, two languages speak the same name, Jesus our Lord. This is uh, one of the main events that I ever experienced. Thank you God for this opportunity and thank you for my brothers and sisters. Gracias a mis hermanas y hermanos que vinieron a compartir el Evangelio juntos, no importando el idioma ni el color. Dios les diga, thank you again, thank you God, thank you Lord. Thank you, my brothers. Thank you, Mr. Manas. God bless you. We had some who would just uh, come in from Detroit, Michigan, and get the left dialysis. Wow. And, we, and we don't know who's knocking on doors. You know, it just made us all feel real good about uh, from the older women going out, yeah. knocking on doors, and you know, telling people about Jesus Christ. And that's mm -hmm. what the crusade is all about. As a matter of fact, we had some people who were baptized in Detroit, Michigan years ago. Who are still with the crusade and they're right down here right wow. now. And what do you think about it too, bro? Well, I just think it's tremendous commitment. It shows the resilience mm -hmm. of the body of Christ mm -hmm. to do the will of God in spite of circumstances. So I think this just really has shown the faith of God's people. Mm -hmm.